So I have my daughter trying this now to illustrate a couple things. The strength of the force feedback and the feel that a 12-year-old girl is getting from the wheel who is unfamiliar with this game and driving cars. I've noticed while watching her do this that she's naturally correcting for oversteer while going around this corner. She really has no experience um, playing any racing games at all. They just really don't interest her. I just made her sit down and, and try the wheel. But every time the car oversteers, she naturally tries to provide the proper counter steer for it. And I believe that's because the wheel is giving her uh, just a really good amount of feedback. It's hard to describe, and I was hoping that maybe a video like this would illustrate to people just what kind of feel they get for the car. So, and uh, that's also helped me to know that she's not ready to drive a real vehicle yet. So, okay, answering some more questions here. Uh, the first question is Does the wheel shake or rumble when you're revving the gas? And the answer. is sort of. Actually, I can feel it. When I get close to red line, there's actually some rumble in the wheel. I don't know if I can make it noticeable in the video, though. I'm hoping the camera will shake here, but it's not doing it. But the wheel does rumble rubbing the gas when you get hot, really high in the RPMs. And actually it's there even a little lower, but it's not as noticeable as when you get it up here. Right now the wheel's shaking really good. So, interesting question and interesting result. Okay, so another question I had was, when you push the emergency brake, does the clutch engage? So, we're gonna we're gonna see. I have the telemetry up because the results are a little interesting. So I'm gonna take off here. And I'm just gonna punch the emergency brake. So I hit the emergency brake and you can see the clutch uh, bar, I'm gonna try to get my finger in here, yellow bar went up as I was doing it. Now while it went up and it shows it being engaged, it wasn't actually. When I was playing with this earlier, when I had both hands and wasn't trying to hold a camera, I was shifting the gears while I had the emergency brake pressed and it showed the clutch going up, but it was making the grinding sound as if I wasn't using a clutch. So somehow I think uh, anytime the back wheels like fully lock up for more than a few seconds, like if you're cranking on the emergency brake like that, it will, uh, for some reason, engage, uh, open the clutch up there. So I'm not, I'm not really sure how it works, but would it work to basically combine an emergency brake and like kick it in the clutch real quick for drifting? I, I don't know. Um, my guess is no, but you can you can take this for what it's worth. I, 